So we're here at Dimension today with Sky Sports and Nikon for a final production test. It's the first time volumetric capture in our new mobile studio have been used for this innovative live broadcast at the Open at Portrush. It's pretty exciting, let's go and see what's happening. Ultimately what we're really doing is for the first time ever we're visualising a golf swing in all of its dimensions. That takes an unusual combination of an incredible camera company, an incredible robotics company, an incredible capture company and a broadcaster that really pushes the limits of what can be possible. It's an exciting opportunity for us to show volumetric capture live and broadcast and bringing new exciting enhancement to viewers across the world. This is a, the first time this will ever be seen on TV and the end result will show players swinging in the open zone so that the customers watching on TV can see exactly what their swings look like. And we have the uh, ability to bring augmented reality graphics into there so if someone's having a great round we can bring them in and then we can have our pundits analyse the swings like never before. This is a world first in that we are capturing golfers using volumetric video and motion capture all at the same time to make an asset that's never been seen before. And that is essentially a, a holograph of a golfer that can be looked at from any viewpoint and time can be frozen at any point in the action that we've recorded so you can look around and look at their golf swing. Golfers have never been able to analyze or understand their movement and their motion to this level of detail. I think the thing that really stood out to me is just how uh, simple it was to do, how quick it was to do, but also how there was no invasiveness of the whole process. Whereas the volumetric capture and the nature of how they do this, you get a real life image first of all, not a computer generated one, of your actual body, how it's moving. But the tracking of the club is still there, but you're making an uninhibited swing. So you get more reliable data about what you do. So being able to see how the club starts to move down, but also ties into how my legs move, how my left hip gets out the way, being able to move around that swing in real time and be able to look how it's all talking to one another is something that I've never had the opportunity to do before. So for me, that's really cool and it's something that I've never seen.